carbon tax for the burning of all the fossil fuels, regardless of what the farm or the domestic. You know, that is one of the, uh, the proposals that's been made, and uh, I have chosen to support a cap and trade system with an auction where the money would go to enhance our research efforts and provide uh, support for middle income and poor people to be able to handle whatever the cost of energy transition would be. That's my current thing, and that's why I signed on to the Boxer Sanders bill. You know, there's, there's a lot of people making a strong case for a carbon tax. Um, you know, there are some who say, look, it's, it's uh, easier to describe, it's easier to apply, but there are lots of ways to gain that, too. And I have no doubt that the people who would be asked to pay for it would not only try to gain it, but try to pass it on rather than absorb it. So we have to be very carefully um, created and targeted. So currently, I am much more in favor of an economy-wide cap-and-trade system, which I think has a better shot of actually getting the political support that we need and being able to be implemented in pretty short order as long as we don't give away the auction proceeds to the companies. They should not get the auction proceeds. They should have to pay for those permits and then that money should be used for further research and helping middle income and low income people.